Okay, so let's play some more. I, ch I tried turning up the game audio a bit because I, I watched the previous recordings and I realized that the game audio was, was pretty quiet. Especially outside of the cutscenes. Like, you could barely hear anything, which I guess it's fine in some respects and that you can hear me, but I I want you to be able to hear the game too. So I turned it up. Hopefully it's not the game's not too loud now. But we'll just continue onward. So it says I've been playing for four hours and 17 minutes. Previously during the investigation, these puppies are making me go to another town in the boondocks again. I didn't think you'd keep me waiting in the rain for so long. Welcome to Greenville. I'm the sheriff, George Woodman. Call me George. There's definitely something in this town. Do you feel it, Zach? The coffee warned me about it. It's pretty much just the same thing. It, that previously on hasn't really advanced at all, even though I've made quite a bit of progress since then. But okay. Sugar donut. Welcome yeah. back, everyone. Ah, uh, Thomas. Agent Morgan. It's past 2100. Let's meet up again at the community center tomorrow. I haven't been sleeping much since this all started, to be honest. I'm exhausted. I was just about to suggest the same thing. I'll make arrangements for people to gather between 1500 and 1700. I'll try and get as many people as I can to come, so don't be late. Okay? Don't be late. I'll be there. The community center's on the south side. I've marked it on your map. Thanks, Thomas. Well then, see you tomorrow. He's walking like his back hurts. Okay. Yeah, so, as I said last time, like, it's weird that this is 1700. Instead of saying... Or 1500, 700, it's, it's, it's almost 2100, instead of saying it's almost 9. Like, it's not, it's te technically not incorrect, but it's just, that's something that you really hear people say. Okay, so there's the community center is over there. I gotta figure out how to get out of here, though. Wait, really, where'd I go? Tremors. Huh. I think Fred Ward was in it. You say Fred Ward, and I say Remo Williams. The adventure begins. Oh, there that we go. Was back in '85, I think. Directed by Guy Hamilton. Guess Hamilton was aiming to start a series like 007, but it had no sequels. A real shame. Do you remember the martial arts they used in that film, called Sinanju? The ultimate in martial arts, using no weapons at all. Remo's master Chun ran across water, remember? And he loved soap operas. Man, that was a good character. He was played by Joel Grey, the best supporting actor in Cabaret. Of course, in Remo, he had so much makeup on, you couldn't tell. Okay. Because <laughs> you learn a lot about cheesy B-movies. Are you going to open up or what? There you go. I'd never seen that movie before. Ah, uh, 97%. I'm already running low on fuel, great. Or not running low, but... I've already used up a fair bit. <laughs> and it's raining, so it's gonna be slippery out when you try to drive. Look at that. Of course, I'm also driving on the wrong side of the road, but who cares? There's nobody else driving you. I can do what I want. Now, if you said that to a police officer in real life, they wouldn't care. But I am FBI. I'm in charge. They can't do anything to me. Am I even going the right way? Great. I don't even know if I'm going the right way. See that makes that's what's a bit difficult about this game is trying to because you can't see the whole like I click here it just zooms out a bit but it still doesn't show the whole map. So you have to pause this way and then go into the map and then go all the way so I can't go there apparently. Like where am I supposed to go?
I gotta go all the like my goodness look at that that's a really far way to go it's gotta be a quicker way than that is this game not have any fast travel I doubt it does to be honest can't tell what state that says uh, why did you put that there oh so it's decommissioned that's why it was close to, it's not know if it's decommissioned but it's close for construction that's for sure so I guess you can't take this shortcut those shortcuts but I still don't know if they're you could do quick travel Okay, we're almost there. I say almost, relatively speaking. I could, like I said, I'm going to the hotel. I could just sleep elsewhere. Oh, there's actually another car. Looks like it's just sitting there, though, not moving. Is there another shortcut I can take? I don't see one. Yeah, it looks like I could just gotta keep going this way. That car, are those cars even moving? It doesn't look like it. It looks like they're just sitting there. Is there only one gas station in this whole place? I asked that before, I know, but it, it really seems like there's only one gas station. Joel uh -huh. Gray's daughter is, of course. That's right, Jennifer Gray. You knew that, right, Zach? Jennifer Gray. She's in one of my most favorite movies. Ferris Bueller's Day Off. 1986, directed by John Hughes. Huh, that one was so 80s. Zach, you're not the most cheerful guy I know. But you really do like those cheerful movies. We used to love those teenage movies back then, didn't we? Breakfast Club and Pretty in Pink. St. Elmo's Fire and Fast Times at Ridgemont High. That last one was in 1982, directed by Amy Heckerling. Now that was an impressive film. You've got Sean Penn in the lead, with Jennifer Jason Lee and Phoebe Cates, not to mention Nicolas Cage and Forrest Whitaker were in it too. And the original book and the script were written by Cameron Crowe. How could that not be a great film? Do you remember, Zach? It's got Nicolas Cage. When that movie ended, the last words, the end, was from an arcade game. That's right, it was from Missile Command. That stuck in my head for a while. The memories. I feel like I have a lot of movies to catch up on. Let's just hope we can get to the end of this case soon. Then maybe we can catch up on a few. Give some thought about what movie you want to see next, Zach. All right, let's see what this place is all about. Zach, is there something here that you want to check out? We yeah. need to be at the community center by 1500 today. Just think of talking in front of all those people. What do you think, Zach? It's going to get fun. 1500 today. No, it's 1500 tomorrow. I can think. I can see it. Uh, York saying 1500 because that seems like the kind of person he is. Oh, that's literally where I'm supposed to be going. Uh oh, what's it, what's it gonna do? Zach, Emily arranged for people to come between 1500 and 1700. We can't do anything here right now. Let's come back at the right time. Well, what am I supposed to do in the meantime? It's like nothing out here. Look at that, how big the community center is. Why is it out in the middle of nowhere though? Okay, let's see what we got on the map. Are there any guys? Is there a gas station there? I don't see any. Yeah, 
Yeah, I don't see any gas stations there. Hmm. Oh, great. Where, am I, where did I go to? So I'm here. I need to wait. I don't know if... Because he said don't be late. Well, I guess also don't be early, but... Let's go to the diner then. I'm worried about running out of gas, though. What do I do? What happens then? I was going to try to sleep, too, but... Couldn't see you. I couldn't see you anywhere to go. Okay, let's keep going then. I always, I keep on wanting to press right trigger to drive, but it's right bumper. Yeah, so I can actually just drive in there as well, apparently. That's too early. Okay, so okay. I've been thinking about what movie I'd like to watch next, and finally I've made a decision. It's always hard to narrow it down just to one movie, but I've put a lot of thought into this, and I'm sure you'll agree with me. 1975, directed by Steven Spielberg himself, the grandfather of panic movies, set in a small town in Massachusetts. That movie made me stay away from the beach for years. I was always afraid that a hand might come floating up. You know what I'm talking about, right? Yeah? It's Jaws. The underwater camera work accompanied by that John Williams music. I'd never been that scared by a movie before. But the best thing about it is that it isn't just another panic movie. The mayor who won't close the beach even when there are so many victims. And Chief Brody putting the citizens' lives above all else. The film gave a lot of time to the dispute and friction between them. It certainly had a lot of messages for a two-hour film. That's probably another reason why it was such a record-breaking hit. One of my regrets in life is that I didn't see it at the movie theater. I guess I was still just a child back then. But still, I wanted to taste that terror in real time. Well, Sue, that I... reminds me, Zach. Did you know this one? Jaws also appears in another movie that was produced by Spielberg. The second Back to the Future. It was directed by Robert Zemeckis, who later made Forrest Gump. That's also a masterpiece, of course, but we'll discuss that another time. So, the scene where Jaws appears is right after Marty McFly goes 30 years into the future. He passes by a movie theater and is attacked by a holographic shark. Marty is shocked, of course, but looking closer, he sees the words, Jaws Part 19. The director is credited as Steven Spielberg Jr. In reality, there were actually only four Jaws movies. It was still a great joke. 30 years from 1985 would be 2015. We'll be there pretty soon. Oh, uh, we I already. What life would be like by then, Zach? Well, we're already six years past that. <laughs> you don't even have to guess what what it would be like. Is everything closed here? Come on, there's got to be a bar or something I can go to. But if, even the bar is closed. That's closed too. Where do I go? Brian, who's Brian? Anna, Nick. Where's he by suspect? This is literally like nowhere for me to restock on fuel. So what do I do if I run out of gas? I don't even know. Why is it running out of gas so quickly anyways? Zach, is there something here that you want to check out? We need to be at the community center by 1500 today. Just think of talking in front of all those people. What do you think, Zach? It's going to get fun. I can see my house from here. 
This is okay. Let's see what's in here. Loading. Is he my suspect? Didn't he say everyone was a suspect? So you might as well just put suspect over everyone. Yeah, it's locked. Look, there it says 11 p.m. So then why is it? How come when they're talking then they're not saying that? Oh, wow. Well, I didn't park there, by the way. Park there on his own. On its own. And can I get in there? Do I have to wait till the store opens? Get in. Right, let's check in on the suspect here too then. Cause it's free money apparently. Ooh. Money. Prevents them from lowering. Can I go in here? Ah, uh, uh, great. There's that at least. Let's just keep going. Because I don't know where to go. I'm worried about running out of gas. What happens when you run out of gas in this game? I don't even know. We'll find out. Okay. What's that? It looks like a, a bar or something or some club. What is that? Alpha General. So why is it all neon pink? You'd think it's like a strip club or something. You know, it's just some general hmm? store. No, nothing. Just my imagination. Come on, I need to get gas. I need to s do something. Because it's already, it's already only at like, where's the gas station? Is there literally only one gas station in this entire map? Why is it not? I don't see any gas station at all. Hmm. And nothing. Something all the way out there. Just that dead in there. The hospital. It's up there. What's all the way up here? Nothing. Why on earth is, is that... This is the most you can zoom out on the map. You can't zoom out any further. I don't know why they designed the map to be like that. They should give you the option of at least zooming out more to see, have a better understanding of where everything is, relatively speaking. I don't know. I don't see anything. I don't see a gas station anywhere near me. 
You would think that this looks like the main portion of the town. You think that this the main portion would at least have a station? I guess we'll see what happens when it gets towed. I'm gonna take a nap though. So this looks this is like a, the, the residential area. Which is fine, I guess. Well, let me get out. Sleep there. Do I get, get there from another way? And look, it doesn't... Okay, so let's try this again. Cause it looks like there should be someone for me to sleep here. But holding his breath. Okay, so that's the south section. See if I can go get across anywhere. I don't see anywhere where to go. You can carry Jack. No. Dog. Doesn't sound like a dog though. This is one of the other farm animals. I'll see if I, let's, I can just drive right through and knock it to smash that. Yes, I can. There we go. Wasn't sure if it would let me. And I'm not sure if they're going to appreciate that, but hey, I'm doing it anyways. It's almost 10 o'clock. I do a deep sleep. Okay, let's get something to eat then. Let's see what we got. I get all my health back okay when I sleep good. There we go. There we go. I eat. There, so he should be all... His hunger should be satisfied now. Should be feeling pretty good now. He had a good night's sleep, nine hours. Not only did he have a good night's sleep, he's got plenty of time for today. Everything's still gonna be closed though, probably. Maybe he should've slept a bit longer. 12 hours sleep. 12 hours is a bit too long. So, where shall we go next? It's a good question. I I would I would have said the gas station, but I don't see any gas stations near me. And there's only that one singular gas station. That's a problem because it's pretty far away. Is it? Is anything open yet? It's almost seven o'clock. Oh no, it's it's raining. Nobody's gonna show up. Apparently, they're all superstitious, so they don't do anything. Until it, if it's raining, they just all stay home. Yeah. So there's gonna be nowhere to go. Or nothing to do. Let's try that side quest then.
I should be able to buy if I like if there's not much gas I should be able to go and just buy a ton of gas then that I can use when when I need to because otherwise I'm gonna be st stuck Oh, that's what that is. It's the card. So there's other cards too that I gotta take, right? Okay, so it's seven o'clock. Does it do that every half hour or hour? Or is it saying time to wake up? 11 to, you got your 11 to seven sleep? Whoops. Zach, is there something here that you want to check out? We need to be at the community center oh, by 1500 okay. today. I get, am, am I supposed to be Zach? In front of all those people. What do you think, Zach? It's going to get fun. I'm, I'm Zach. Or am I? That's the big question. The brick in the fourth wall. There's nothing. Is there anything I can do? Or is everything all closed? Then maybe I could try doing something to pass the time. So, where shall we go next? Obviously, the game's expecting me to do something, not just do nothing. But I'm worried. I'm running out of gas. Well, let's try this. Whatever this is, a race. Oh my goodness, okay, let's try this. Oh, do you have to? Oh, okay. You have to go a certain way. I thought maybe I could try taking a shortcut, but no, the game won't let you. Ah. Failed. Yeah, I'm gonna have to try that again. Oh, it left me. It let me. Left me here. I should have known that. That's where it was gonna make me turn next. I was thinking it might, but I wasn't a hundred percent sure. Stop. It's all slippery. Where do I go? For gas. I don't go tell you someone to me I gotta go to that one guy every time. No, I thought maybe I could just smash through that. But apparently it's too durable. It's raining, so there's gonna be there's nothing I can do really. Everything's closed. Well, especially if George's believe that people are superstitious and they don't do they don't do anything on the, when it rains. Just considering how often it rains, it seems like they're gonna be really disruptive. Hmm. I don't know. I'm getting worried though. It's running low. The damage is fine. Oh, 86. Oh, well, it's getting down now, but that's because I was taking shortcuts. I haven't told the car or anything. Oh, I was close though. I didn't even notice how close I was getting to the fence. Right, let's just keep running. Still closed. What time does it open?
What is this anyways? Is it a bar? Why would a bar be closed at this hour? Oh, okay, okay, I can get it being closed now, but why was it closed at like 10 p.m.? What kind of bar closes at 10 p.m.? I guess one that doesn't expect any customers. Yeah, it's a, it's a bar root beer. Is it root beer with actual like beer in it, or is it like the pop? Oh, what's that up there? A record player. Hmm. No way I'm gonna tr bother trying to get all of these. I'm not going for a completionist run. <laughs> That'd take forever. There you go, that's what I wanted. It's seven o'clock. It's gonna take forever to turn to, to three o'clock. So I'm just gonna say screw it. We're gonna s see what happens if I run out the the gas tank. Is something's gonna ha gotta happen? Everything's closed right now. Is this how people feel when they wake up early in the morning and everything's closed and they just gotta wait for everything to open up? Cause I never wake up that early, anyways. No, I never go out anyways, especially with COVID. We're locked down. <laughs> We're so, locked down anyways. Where shall so, we go next? There's nowhere for me to go. Even when we weren't on lockdown though, I wouldn't I'm not someone just wake up really early in the morning to go somewhere. That's probably where I needed to go. Nope. That was close. I really hope it's not a game over. But I can't figure out what to what I'm supposed to be doing right now. So I'm just gonna try to run out the, the gas tank on this to see what happens. Yeah, this is where I'm supposed to be going anyways, but I'm gonna keep off I'm gonna have to keep driving. Cause it looks like I actually did not have enough. What's that noise? Oh, it's warning me that I'm running out of fuel. Yeah, well, I'm doing that on purpose because I don't know what else I'm supposed to be doing. Everything's closed. Just keep going. I don't know if there's quick teleport in this. A quick travel, I guess is what they would call it. But I'm just gonna run the, the gas tank out and just to see what happens. Where I need to be anyways. So, I should be able to still get to what I need to do, but I'm just gonna be, I'll just be waiting for a while. We're getting there. Three percent left. I almost said degrees. How did I get money from that? I'm sideswiping. Hit and run. There we go, we're almost there. Oh, so even when you're at 0%, it still gives you a bit left. 
before it completely stalls out. Come on. Still letting me go, surprisingly. Come on, keep going. What am I supposed to do now? It was a car accident. It wasn't really an accident, though. More intentional, or like, I can't do anything. Yeah, it won't let me do anything. So I guess I just gotta keep running now. I'm in the middle of nowhere. <laughs> See if I have any options. Key flag. Trading card, profiling. Options. No. It's a cruel production. That sounds kind of, that sounds really weird. Zach, Emily arranged for people to come between 1500 and 1700. We can't do anything here right now. Let's come back at the right time. They said that do not be late. And so I just wanted to make sure that I wasn't late. Can I call? To have someone come fix the car? Maybe? Oh, how did that... Wait a second. Is that my car? Ah. Oh, I didn't know there was another car I could use. If I had known there was another car, I would have used it. Without totaling, uh, without completely using that one up. So it doesn't help that I don't know where to go, though. Or do anything when everything's closed. Literally everything's closed. Hi, kitty. I like my cat, but she's very particular with how she wants to be treated. She doesn't. She only lets you pet her at specific times. I should have slept longer, apparently, because I can't do anything. Let's see if the library is open yet. Probably not. Yeah, closed. Of course it's closed. Everything's closed. Is there nothing I can do to pass the time? Let's just go here, I guess. Let's see what we have. I don't know though, because it doesn't seem like this is going to go anywhere, it seems like a dead end. Wait, it is a dead end, but that means I, I can still, there's nothing to stop me from driving through it. Maybe we just have fun driving through the wilderness.
So this is like the first extended section where you can just kind of do whatever you want, but I haven't been spending that time very well. Oh god. Let's just go over there and see what we got. Almost 2,000 yards. I like how it says yards instead of like say miles or whatever, like 2.8 miles. I guess. It's fine. Remember when I used to play Spider Man 2 on the PS2 when it showed like the marker for distance? I used to think that was how the time left, so I was like, always like, wow, it just barely made it in time. But yeah, of course that's not what it was. Let's just go here and see what we got. But if it's raining, they said everyone stays home, then that means I'm not going to be able to go anywhere. Or do anything, but we'll see, just see. It. There's another car I can use anyways too, if I need to. From the looks of it. Zach, is there something here that you want to check out? Yes. You need to be at the community center by 1500 today. Just think of talking in front oh, of all those people. Oh, I can actually go in here. What do you think, Zach? Let's see what we got here. Nice. What kind of place is this? What just happened? What the hell just happened? Runtime error. How did that happen? It froze. Why did it freeze? Great. I didn't. When was the last time I saved? Oh my goodness. How was I supposed to know that was going to happen? Well, that's an issue. If this game keeps crashing, I can't play it. What? I say keep. That was the first time it crashed, but I don't know why it crashed. That's the issue. Like, I don't even know when I last saved, to be honest. We'll have to see. It seemed pretty random too. I, uh... Okay. Let's try it again. At least I know I can switch cars. Like, but... Previously during the yeah, investigation. Yeah. Let's see what time it, it is. But it's before I saved before or after I went to sleep. After, okay. Is it a bit more manageable, I guess? Because it means that I don't have to worry about the car penalty, because I, I know now that I can just get another car, but I don't know why it did that. It didn't really explain what ha why that happened. Wait, was that him panting? Being tired? Alright, let's go. Where did I put my car? I don't even remember where I put the car. And it's gotta be it right there. Yeah. That's why, I guess that's what it means by master key. Because that was the... No, it's, I don't even remember where I was going exactly. But I don't know why it froze either. Because I still don't even know if I'm going to be able to get there. If the game freezes again, I don't know what I'll do. Zach, if you notice anything, just stop me. 
keep going this way, I guess. I think what I did is I, I only took a left here. And then I just went straight past that, but I'm not 100% sure that that's what I did. Can I at least, can I take those cars? I doubt it, it'll let me. We'll try though. No, it won't. I, I should have figured. That's what would happen. <laughs> Alright, let's keep going then. Ah, it's gonna hit it. Looking back, it seems kind of strange now that they even made a sequel. Oh, maybe it was the, it was the Pepper Street I had to go down. Probably was. Alright, let's just go down this way. <clears throat> and hope so, that I got it. we go next? No, it's not. It's just a similar dead end. Like the, some residential area of the town. Um, so I'm just gonna have to go left then. We'll try that. Nice. He's really good at recovering, apparently. You can recover from like almost total in, or like Washington. So that's where we are. So this actually does take place in an American state. I guess that's why they say that's why it rains so much. It was in Washington. It always rains in Washington. Oh, it's this way. I gotta go. Yes, I think it is. See, that's why I gotta open up the large map. And check to make sure because it won't let me just see the bigger map here. I still wish it would have like an actual full pan out of the can of the map. That would help immensely. I'm gonna ha hope that I can get there in time. Yeah, I'm gonna make it. Not really on time. It's with enough, with gas left. Pretty much an empty tank, but that's fine. There's other cars here that I can use. This is open, yeah. Was it really open though? If it, if it crashes the game when I tried when I tried to do it. It doesn't really look open to me. It's open, technically, I guess. I would just take someone's leftover coffee. Can I order anything here? I don't know. Oh, it's the hotel. Oh, hi. Okay. Talk oh, some more. Hi. Any more? You got anything bigger than that? A rod. Yeah. Let's buy a rod. So I can go fishing. I got six thousand bucks to spare. Apparently, I need to buy some bait too, though. And get some cheddar cheese, because why not? I'll try to take it easy, but...
Oh, so I can't eat anything till noon. Take an egg. Just eat that. See what's my status at, anyways. I'm fine. He's not really hungry, and he's not tired either. I can save though. Go fishing if it'll let me. I don't know if it'll let me go fishing in the. Oh, you got a paid. I like how it does that when you go to the map. Okay, I gotta get out of here. And then try to go fishing. Because I don't want to go fishing. Oh, so yeah, it always puts, it, it just puts them in place. Oh, wait, let me get that. How do I get to there? Oh, okay, I see. Agent Honor. The so receptionist is, I think, is what it means. Oh, I thought it would let me go that way, but no, I gotta go the other way. Good exercise is though running like that for who knows how long. See, I don't even know. I don't want to like run the whole time because I don't know what happens when he gets tired out. if you're gonna oh that chair moves it's a haunted chair I just wanted to go fishing how do I get there yeah use the submachine gun on it it's a bit overkill you don't you think No, I, he doesn't think that. He doesn't have much etiquette. The swing set. Okay. I want to go here. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, you can't do when you're right up to it. You have to go back a bit. Alright, let's see what we got here. Still not letting me go. Oh, there we go. It's weird. It's like it wouldn't let me go at first. That's a lot. Of, like, blockades and that just... That I have to get to just to go fishing. Wow. We'll just keep going down this way. See what there is. Yeah, cause what's this? Huh. This flower. There's something very mesmerizing about it. I wonder what it's called. I'll take one with me and ask someone later. A flower with no name. <laughs> All right, let's go fishing now. It should let me go fishing, even if it's raining. Raining is probably even a good, a good time to go fishing. Yes. You'll lose one bait. Oh. There you go. It's a great way to spend my time. I 
I don't know if I'm supposed to be doing something. It, oh. Oh. Fail, no. Alright, let's try that again. I don't even know how long this is supposed to take. Time wise. I guess I should have taken a 12 hour sleep instead. I'm not gonna get it this time either. Oh, so yeah, you, what you get is, okay, I see now. But I get Emily every time. I don't think you need to get the gift, necessarily. Come on, there we go. Got something at least. I caught a first aid kit. So can you not catch an actual fish? I guess we'll see. It's just going like that forever. <laughs> it's not noon. I didn't catch any fish. I don't know if that means I don't I can't get anything now because I already got something before. Oh I guess I can't get something. Yeah, come on, stop! No! So close. I don't know if it's randomized or if it's the same every time. In terms of like that order there. On the, the slot, it's pretty much slots. Nothing. Try it again. Oh, this is the life. It really is. Okay, so it looks like it is the same every time. Oh, I got that at least. Still not the gift though. Alright, let's just keep going until we got no more worms for now. What happens if it's, you get food? Like, is it gonna be an actual fish? So was fish an option? I don't even remember now. Okay. A sickle. I could get a hammer too. A hammer and a sickle. I remember in like 2010 or 2000, I don't remember if it's 2010 or 2011, but the game came out in 2010. We were playing Rappler Pro Bass Fishing on the Xbox 360 and we played it quite a bit. It seems Game Rides are kind of like pure pool, it's like a game I don't typically play in that genre yet for those like a one game particularly we played a ton of. Yeah, that was, which I mean that would have been about a decade ago. That's crazy. I think how long ago that was already.
kind of crazy to even think about that. No. Okay, I got that at least. I already had a sickle. It's 2,298 yards. It's saying that. Yeah, so it's not really, there's not really much to it than the fishing. It's not like a huge mini game or anything. It's not that interactive. I still have three worms left though. So we'll just, I'll just keep doing this until I don't got any worms left because I don't know what else I'm supposed to do. Apparently everything's closed until, until it stops raining, which isn't until about noon. Looks like I might be out of luck though. So do they even know you're fish does she even know you're fishing? But you I bought the rod and the bait from the hotel, so they would know I'm fishing. Okay, come on. Keep trying to throw it in, I guess. I don't know if it's gonna if there's anything more for me to catch right now. Doesn't look like there is. Yeah, and then nothing. Oh, I spoke too soon. I got bullets or ammunition. Well, if I keep catching things, so it's n I'm not gonna lose any worms. So I may just wait till later, because I don't know. It may take forever before I lose all my worms. And I don't know if I should just keep doing this for, <laughs> indefinitely, like that. Nice. Okay, that's good enough. I barely took any time, wow. I'm just gonna go to sleep then. This time goes by really slowly in this game. But then I'm at the hotel. I better save in case the game crashes again. I don't know why I did that last time. I don't even remember where my room is. To be honest. Oh, I guess it's that one right there. Right, let's just save. So it does cost money to save, but that's fine. Is this my room? I don't even remember which room was mine.
Yeah, this has got to be my room. Pretty big hotel room. What's this showing? Can you just spend this time to watch a movie? We wanted to do. So it may not be raining anymore. It looks like it's sunny out. So let's just see then. Oh. Let's just eat something. You don't need to be fully like he said he's pretty fine. Looks like he's in pretty good. Shape. Okay, let's get out of here. This should cook something up for me. Oh, hi. Doesn't look like it. Wait, what is that? Hi. What was the flare for? It will buy its uh, some flares, I guess. Oh, how typical. Okay. And of course, she sells machine gun ammo. I don't know how many hotels would sell machine gun ammo. I guess it is in the United States. So it's not, the good thing is it's not raining anymore. And I can eat now. So the diners are open. Open until one o'clock. So let's get something to eat. Why not? As long as you don't hit that car. Yeah, so this takes place in Washington. All the West Coast. Well, it might, might not be on the actual West Coast, but West Coast State. Zach, if you notice anything, just stop me. Yeah, yeah, okay. I'll try it, okay. I'm pretty sure Zach is supposed to be referring to us. Like breaking the fourth wall, but I'm not 100% sure of that. Oh, I just saw somewhere I could go. Yes, I think I did. Try to get a shortcut. Yeah, go up here. Aha. There we go. I think this is where I went last time. The shortcut. Of course, if somebody saw me jumping, like, that's probably warning what on earth I'm doing. But what makes even less sense is why is there just a road that stops like that? It doesn't cut through. I guess, I guess it's privately owned. Ah. Oh. I guess I can't just go down there. Alright, let's go down this way then. Ah, uh, no, it's tick. It was coming along with me for the ride. We're not quite in the residential area. We're in the residential. Okay, there we go. Let's go to the diner. Guess the oh, that was close. Why well, you don't look at your map while you're driving? You don't get distracted while you're driving. Keep focused on the road.
Man, let's get a bite to eat though. Zach, is there something here that you want to check out? We need to be at the community center by 1500 today. Just think of talking in front of all those people. What do you think, Zach? It's going to get fun. Yeah, you said it like three times already. <laughs> I think I, it's like he looks, takes a peek in to see what it's like before it actually just eating in there. But let's, I want to see what it looks like, I guess. What? It looks like the police station. Isn't that, wasn't that the police station? That's weird. Oh, I better not take my gun out randomly. Oh, this is the police station. That was weird. I was wondering why it looked like the police station because it said it was like a place to eat. Uh, well, what am I supposed to do in here then? Oh, I can go in there. Okay. Get something to eat. Why not? The office, so yeah. So I'm just instead of going to rest, I'm just gonna go to the police station to get some guy to make food for me. Hello. Yes, please. So, what exactly do you want to talk to everyone about? This case goes deeper than you think. The town folk may have heard about the murder, but they don't understand it. It's a very dangerous situation, and I need to warn them properly. I hope most of them are decent enough to come. No problem there. Emily has made all the arrangements. I've told everyone to gather around between 1500 and 1700. Great. The waffles. Reminds me of a film I saw recently. The town is under attack by aliens. And so the mayor calls all citizens to the town hall to warn them. Now overseeing this, the aliens attack the hall and wipe them all out together. Is that relevant, Agent York? The way they kill is fantastic. They used a combination of balloons and meat sauce for exploding heads. Those aliens start firing their death rays and heads start popping. Like splat. Really quite something. Agent York, some of us are trying to eat here. I know, Emily. I'm one of them. Well, anyway, your cooking is the best, Thomas. Thank you. Nope, no problem. He didn't even eat the same food. Okay. I did have breakfast. I just ate. Oh, you can... Okay. You can open the door more quickly that way, apparently. Be running while you open the door. Yeah, you can. Okay. It's good that I know that then. There you go, I had lunch. Looks like I ate something to- whoa. He's going out to the abyss. Why was it all white there? It was just nothing- a pure nothingness outside. So I've got about two hours before I've got anywhere to go. Before I gotta be there. There's a lot of cars here though. Let's see which one I can. Well, I assume that's one of it by having the master giving me the master key. Well, it's gonna go. There goes the mailbox. Oh, I'm just gonna be—I'm gonna be charged for a federal crime now. 
for disrupting the, the uh, mail, the postal box. So, where shall we go next? Let's try this. Another diner. I wasn't hungry. I didn't eat enough. I need some more food. There's a suspect in here too, isn't there? Yeah, I doubt you can run into that. Or you can try to run into it, but it has to load. Well, this is actually a fair bit of people here. It's more than I was expecting. Can they order anything? Oh, oh, oh. Talk yes. to him. That's all. Can I talk to her? No, don't freeze. Ah, oh, I was right next to a save slot. And I didn't, I decided not to save. Ah! Why does it keep doing that? It crashed again. I can't do anything. I was right next to a save spot. I was like, no, I won't save. I'll just talk to them first, but I should have saved. Yeah, it won't let me. Won't let me do anything. You game, this game. Completely frozen, won't even let me close out on it. Hopefully. 